Hey babes, it's Sav and welcome back to Sav's Reality and happy Halla freaking Ween! I am so excited that it's Halloween. I'm not getting to do like as many Halloween festivities as I wish I could, but that's just what happens when you become an adult. But anyways, today I'm going to be getting ready, getting in costume, and I wanted to get ready with y'all. So stay tuned for a get ready with me for this Halloween. I will be a cave woman. So let's go ahead and jump right into that. So I'm going to start by putting this Dr. Brandt Illuminizing Primer over my eyes just to prep everything, get it ready to go, because I'm planning on wearing this eyeshadow look beyond my Halloween festivities, so I want it to look good for a really long time. Now that I have my eyes primed and ready to go, I'm also going to prime my face. I'm using this new one from e.l.f. and I'm not used to using primers and this one's okay, but I don't think it's my favorite, but I'm definitely going to use it because it gets the job done. So now using my James Charles palette, I'm going to go into the shade canvas and just put down a nice base for my eyes to build shadow on top of. So now using one of my original favorites, the Morphe 3502, I'm going to go in with a super fluffy brush and these three browns. Really, that's all it is. Just a really big fluffy brush, mixing these three browns together and just going at it. There's really no precision or anything to this. It's, I actually recommend being quite messy with it because you can clean it up later when you do your foundation. So I'm just going to go in and do a basic smoky eye and this is perfect for it. Now using this black shadow that I just have in one of my Z palettes, I'm going to go in and just dab that in the outer corner just to deepen the eyes. Now I'm going to go in with my Lancome La Base and put that in so I can cut the crease. Again, super messy with it. Why be precise when you don't have to? Now taking my pinky, because pinky's up for my ladies and iota, I'm going to take the shimmer shadow. Honestly, just any shimmer shadow. I think this one's like a loose one from the bomb. I'm just going to put that on my inner corner. And now taking that same fluffy brush, I'm just going to go through and I'm going to blend it until I'm happy. Okay, so that's all for the makeup. For my hair, I'm really just going to let it down and brush it through. You could just leave it up. Um, there are a few different options of what you could have done with your hair. Um, but I'll show you what I chose today. I'll go ahead and put on my costume and I'll show you how it turned out.